Hello, thank you for joining us for another MDAR bite sized Vulbus training video. Uh, this one we're going to look at the multi touch modes of the glass panels. A little bit advanced, but we're getting asked questions about how do we uh, trigger multiple scenes when we've only got a one, two, or four button panel. So let's take what I've, this demonstration rig as an example. I've got a two button uh, glass panel on it, and one button just switches the lights on and off. The other button, however, I can choose between uh, comfort mode or if I press and hold the button, I can choose night mode. Now, I've done it this way because uh, thermostats don't support long press and short press events, not like lights or dimmers. So you have to split the buttons up. So we do it by uh, configuring the module and we activate one of the virtual buttons. So in this scenario, I've uh, added immediately to button three and I've gone to the button mode double click here and I've selected dual mode and this simply asks me which button do I want to have to be triggered when I press it press button two for, for two seconds and I've selected button three which I've called night mode and I want it to be triggered after I've held the button down for two seconds that's it that's as simple as it is so I now when it's short pressed I have a comfort action and when it's long pressed for two seconds it pretends to press button three and that triggers night mode. We could expand it a bit further by calling scenes so instead of uh, night mode and day mode I could activate all these other buttons and we can use multi-step mode and I can say the first button is going to be button two and the last button is going to be button eight. So what would happen is every time you press button two, it would step through button two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. And if you really want, you can, after five seconds, it'll reset and go back to button two, depending on what you want to try to achieve. So you could have every single virtual button having a different, there you go, and if I activate it, you can see these other buttons appear. All these other buttons could have different scenes and you're simply stepping through each one. So again, you see the icons changed from D to M. So that says we've gone from dual mode to multi-step mode, but let's change it back because otherwise I'll get confused and I'll take it on site. There we go. And we want the next one to be night mode. I'll just disable those so it takes it back. So it's that simple. That's dual mode and multi-mode and don't, never forget to synchronize it and there you go that's it that's uh, dual mode and multi-mode explained thanks for watching and keep an eye out for our other bite-sized training